Right now, I am backstage with the extremely talented Shilpa Rao. Welcome to Los Angeles and to Showbiz India. Your show just started. How are you feeling? I think I can hear the energy, the the whole spans of of, of the the noise people are making. So really geared up to go up next. But yeah, really excited. So tell me about your performance. What's your first performance? How do you kick off the show? I'm kicking off the show with uh, my song Yaria from Cocktail, and then to many other songs, I'll keep it as a surprise. And why is this song very close to you? Somehow, the, the whole way it's been written, uh, Ishaji has written it so beautifully and Pritam actually had given me a lot of freedom and space to do whatever I wanted for the song. So I think it became one of my favorites because of all these reasons, yeah. Now, you have an incredible story and an incredible journey into Bollywood. Tell us and our viewers a little bit about that. Well, it's been uh, nice, sweet, bitter, salty, ugly, many things, but uh, the the one big thing I, I'm i happy about and very, very grateful is that I've worked with many nice uh, musicians, great musicians and uh, have learned so much in the whole process, so that's one thing I'm really grateful about, yep. So what would you say was the turning point in your career for you? I think the first song itself from Anwar, Tose Nana Lage, was very small film but um, the songs ended up being huge hits and people still associate me with that so that's something which I really cherish yes I do so how does it feel for a singer you have such a beautiful voice and then you see someone else lip singing it okay. what does that feel like it's it's great I mean I'm, I'm <laughs> you know they think you do it better than us for sure <laughs> so that that's a good thing it, we're in able hands that that's great but um, we, I've done Unplugged, I've, I've done uh, MTV Coke Studio, so you know, what, I've, I've not seen myself on television myself and I've never done that. So whenever it comes on TV, I change my channel, so I've never seen that. Oh no, you shouldn't! <laughs> you're Somehow. You're Somehow. Okay, so you're so extremely talented. Tell me some of the people that you looked up to in your profession growing up. Well, um, I started listening to music and, and it was Amir Khan Saab. So that's how I started. There's Medhyasin Saab, there's Nusrat Saab, uh, and of course my Guruji Harir and uncle. So he is the reason why I'm here and, and I do whatever I do, it's because of him. So I really owe everything to, to all those things. He's taught me the, the confidence he's had in me. And I think um, he made me realize that I can do this and I can be good at this. So if it weren't for him, I don't think I would be here. Tell me, when was the first time you realized you have this special talent? It was, I think, him. Because I was learning music uh, growing up because my father, he, he lives for music. So he was my first ever reason to be a musician and learn music. But I never took myself seriously. And it was only after I met Harir and Uncle and uh, the way he uh, encouraged me, saying, you do have that quality that you need to be a singer so from then on it, it I, I start focusing my energies there yeah and I'm sure music means a lot to you but if you could define music in your life what would you say I think it takes many forms um, each point in your life you feel that music becomes something for you but then you never entirely know what it can do for you because at every given point it, it changes forms it, and it comes to you in the most unexpected ways. So um, I'm still to be surprised by how music is gonna change my life. And that's how I'm living life. So can you tell me some of your favorite songs? Well, there is, uh, there's definitely Tose Nana, there's, there's Khuda Jaane. There's Man Marziya, which I, which is my close favorite from Lutera. And um, definitely Yariya. <laughs> Yeah. For sure, yes. Would you mind singing just a small little piece for the audience? Definitely. Ab jine ko jane ko na koi rasta Tanhaiyo se hoga ab dil ka vasta Ab hasate hasate tum pe le khushia variya very, very nice. So tell me, when you get on stage and you hear that thunderous applause, what do you feel at that time, energy-wise? 
um i feel thank god they're making noise because if they weren't i would be like okay what am i supposed to do so it, it's really really important for us to feel that chemistry with with the audience and and that's the only prayer i do before i go on stage please god let the audience be receptive that's all it was lovely chatting with you go break a leg as they say in showbiz have a great concert don't say break a leg actually broke my leg in one of the performances yeah. oh no 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 okay don't break a great it. time you guys have a great time and the audiences will have a great time that's all i know